really left a newborn baby and a child in here by themselves. Myra Law, a worker in Food Max, took dramatic video of two kids being left in a car on a hot Bakersfield summer day. The whole van, the windows were all up. The van was actually on. Um, the little boy ended up unlocking the door where we were able to get into the van and the air wasn't even like cold. It, the car was on and the AC was on, but the inside of that car, it was hot. But the reason they found the kids was because one of the boys figured out how to get out of the car and was crying, looking for his mom, who was nowhere to be found. The kid was brought inside, but was met with an unhappy mother. She was verbally cussing him out in front of everybody in the store. It was loud to where it got everybody's attention. She hit that little boy. She pulled them by the hair, shook them really bad when she was pulling the hair. And then, like I mentioned, the little boy had no shirt. She was hitting that little boy, striking that little boy with an open hand, slapping him across the body. Which resulted in a group going outside and finding a newborn baby also in the car. A group tried to stand behind the car to keep the guardian from leaving while they called the cops, but that didn't work. What? Your baby's not buckled. Who told you guys to come over? Your baby just came. Did try to stand behind the van to not let her leave, but she ended up getting into the van and didn't care that we were back there. She almost struck us with her van and she took off uh, driving like a maniac without the kids even being buckled inside the van. Law says she took the video because she wanted to help. My motherly instinct was like record. There's no what if, no, this didn't happen. I just wanted to make it clear what was going on so she couldn't deny it. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.